the show loosely based on Brock's early life and featured Tyler James Williams, Terry Crews, Tequan Richmond, Tashina Arnold, Imani Hakim and Vincent. CW decided to strand the sitcom on Little Washed Friday nights, added to the fact that Chris doesn't exactly match the network's targeted demographic. It was obvious that the show's days were numbered. Rather than take a chance on not being able to give the show a proper ending, Rock decided to finish the show on his own terms. The season 4 finale revolved around Chris dropping out of high school, just as Rock did in real life. If the series had returned for year 5, it could have explored his journey to do stand-up, but as it is, the season finale still works as a lot episode. That being said, the fact that the live action Everybody Hates Chris was highly acclaimed and that Rock and other key people are attached to the new project greatly help the animated version's chances of getting greenlit sooner than later. And knowing this, it's possible to figure out a ballpark estimate of the release date. For Variety, another major CBS Studios animated project, Star Trek, was greenlit in April 2019 and is set to premiere in 2021 on Paramount. Knowing this, and assuming that everybody hates Chris gets the green in 2021, we can probably expect the inaugural season of Young Chris's Animated Adventures to drop sometime in 2023. Everybody Hates Chris dropped its first season in 2005. The show became quite popular as more and more people turned in to watch the sitcom inspired by the teenage years of the comedian Chris Rock. The series were created by Chris Rock himself and Ellie. The show was nominated for a Golden Globe and several Emmys. Everybody Hates Chris is known for its writing and humor and has a knack for making its viewers tear up with laughter. The series finale premiered in 2009 and ended with a cliffhanger. However, that was its last season as the show was cancelled after that. Hence here, we have Everybody Hates Chris ending explained. The show was initially made for Fox but after they passed it was picked up by UPN and later moved to the CW. The show starred Tyler James Williams, Terry, Tishina, Tequan, Imani and Vincent. Chris Rock later announced that the series matched his past and that it was time for it to end. Years later, the show is still adored by fans, as fans still have an unanswered after the show ended on a cliffhanger. Years later, the star of the show, Tyler James, finally answered it. In the series finale, Chris was at the end of his summer fall. Year due to his multiple bus changes, Chris was late for school most of the time. Despite him being caught up with his schoolwork, he was told that he might have to repeat the year because of his tardiness. He ultimately failed to improve his punctuality and could not move on to the next grade. Chris decided to then drop out instead of repeating the year. He then decided to get a GED so that he could get a decent job. He took the test and the series finale ended with his mother opening the result as he waited for her to tell him. After which the show was cancelled and fans never actually got to know whether he passed. Years later, Williams did a Q&A on his Twitter where he was asked whether Chris passed or not. Tyler confirmed that he did pass. He dropped out of high school, got his GED and worked odd jobs before making his way as a comedian. Tyler also said that there had been a few talks about a reboot but it has not been possible yet because of the busy schedule of the actors. Thank you for watching, please subscribe to get some more.